Hey guys! So today we are jumping back into our Disney Princess Challenge. Today is just going to be focusing on our seven kiddos here. There's a lot that we still need to do for them. Um, reading back over the rules, I saw that I needed to get one of their character values up. Oh, okay, Duff. <laughs> Part of their thing is you need to get one of their character values up to like in range for one of the traits before they become a teenager. I didn't realize that, but oh my goodness, these are like the best kids besides the toddlers who just aged up. But all four of these guys, manners and responsibility are like top notch. I'm so proud of them. They're so impressive, but I want to make sure that we could take care of them, make sure they get up to the point of getting to, I want the boys like get up to being teenagers. I want the other two to get up to at least a B today. Like if I could get all four of the kids aged up into teenagers, that would be a little bit ridiculous. Um, and then I need to work on their needs and stuff as well. Girl, just leave her alone. Snow is kind of, no, 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 put her down. Snow is kind of just here to be here. We're gonna just have her do her thing. I'm basically just gonna be using her to make sure that everybody is taken care of. Right now, this episode is just focused on these kiddos, making sure they have everything that they need done. So you have a skill to level four, level two. Y'all are doing great. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Where are we going? Oh, okay, so we're going to go drink. Oh, we're at the romance festival. Okay. <laughs> You can't go home right now. I got things I gotta be doing. I guess I'll just have them build their skills. Build your mental skill, guys, because that helps us. We can have them do a bunch of things. She's just doing karaoke. Okay, Snow, we never do anything with you, girl. I told, I told you guys we weren't gonna do anything with Snow and she said, I don't respect that answer and brought us to get some soccer tea. Harvest all. Don't let anybody else have this stuff. And then we'll have her and her friends pour some tea together. Just take it all. What is Bjorn? Not Bjorn. What is Bjorn? Is it Bjorn? I don't know how to pronounce his name. But what is he wearing? Let's have her scope her surroundings. Just because, you know, we're out here. We're no longer with Florian. We might as well see if there's anything that she likes around here. She hasn't noticed anyone interesting. Okay, hey, that's totally fine. I wasn't sure if she would. Well, this is done. Our event is over. So I'm just gonna have her go home because she's tired and we have kiddos there, seven kiddos that we need to take care of. But I'm glad we got out and about with snow for a little while. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can do. Have you collect the eggs and clean the coop? You're scared of something. Well, you're a little timid girl. Lumid Dread from Fear of the Dark. Oh, I haven't gotten that one yet. Dove will be afraid during the nighttime and may struggle to stay asleep. Poor girl. Oh, our little guy's also afraid of the dark. We got three hatchable eggs. Yes, you go and go to sleep. These two are playing together. What are you doing? We're not causing a mess. No, no, miss ma'am. Go ahead and come stack the block. Let's see, what are their skills at? So Miss Ella's, they're all pretty bad to say the least for everyone. I need to get them signed up for preschool. Sun on Monday, they'll go to preschool. And I did private preschool for the other four. So I feel like it's only fair to do private preschool for these little Todds. Dang, dream? It makes sense for him though. He's already asleep, but that makes sense for him because he's, he's dream and he's sleepy. Why don't you get some leftovers, dude? You're hungry. All of your needs are bad. You're doing what? Oh, we can get rid of all of these now, which is crazy. I think I might've talked about it in the last episode, but once we get the triplets up to level three and everything, I want to do a renovation on the house because we do not have, like, we have a toddler room and then a child room, but we don't really have any place for these three to go when they become children. So I wanted to kind of redo the entire top floor and like reposition things, maybe put Snow's bedroom over here and make this entire area for the kids. 
something like that i'm not sure but let me know if you guys want to be a part of that i can stream that so i do stream every week speaking of which if you want to join me on stream I stream Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday here on my channel. And then starting next week, I'll stream on Mondays on my Twitch and we'll play whatever we want over there. But Wednesday, Friday, Saturday is strictly just for Sims content. If you want to join, I'll leave all that information down below. Everyone should be going to sleep now. It is 1130 at night. Snow needs to wake up because she's going to be up all night. Yes. No. Go to sleep. No, ma'am. Clean up these diapers. Try and get them ready for bed. It's the craziest little toddlers. No, girl, you're going to sleep. We're not doing all this. Okay, girl. Go around. Tuck him in. I'd say tuck these guys in, but they're on the top bunk and you can't really do that. But you can spray the monster under the bed just in case. And then come in here, tuck in these little babies, and then clean up all the plates. No, I need you to cook something instead, girl, because I need you to be able to put something out for the kiddos. So if you could make some more grilled cheese. Can you put that down? Great. It's like a whole process. Just thought I would have Snow go for a little bit of a run just while all the kids are sleeping. Just gives her something nice to do out all alone hanging out without the kiddos for a minute she'll go back to the house and then we can get started on her chores and then when the kids wake up we can always have them help out now that they're old enough which is really nice it was a lot of work oh it's harvest fest that's fun we can celebrate that so we need to clean the shed oh the little baby had a nightmare and older brother Rebel came in to make sure he was okay. Well, you better clean that up. Oh, it doesn't really look like the kids care for Harvest Fest all too much. I mean, it looks like two of the little babies like the eating part from being a charmer and from being angelic. And then Rebel likes decorating from being a perfectionist. But other than that, they don't really care for the holiday. Probably because they're children. Can the boys do that? Hatch eggs. Oh, that's cool. She's hungry. Girl, eat. Oh, it's so cute how the kids can do it too. Why don't you take care of this? And Rebel is awake, so I'll have him take care of the garden today. Do some weeding and some watering, my guy. You can watch after the toddlers. You need to take care of yourself, girl. So come get some leftovers. You too, my guy. You need to use the restroom and to bathe. He's so lazy. Which I guess makes sense since he's a lazy sim. Did you do everything I asked you to do? No. We're really trying over here to take care of all these little, all these people, all these little people. And now since your needs are all good to go, you can do some laundry because it's starting to pile up, girl. So if you could just handle that a little bit, like put this away and move this into the dryer when you're done. Okay, he's gonna ask her advice. Finally, we got you on something. When you're done doing that, you need to work with these chickens a little bit. Oh, you're hungry. How are your needs? No violin, come feed these chickens. Scatter food nearby collect the eggs how are our toddlers okay she's waking up i think because she's hungry and you guys need to get your stuff up so why don't you wander around a little bit and he's still sleeping he did his homework how are you girl did you do what i told you to do did you do the laundry no put this away what are you doing snow what do you got yeah go check on the toddlers they're so good. They're such good kids. Like they're doing a great job. Move and add laundry to the dryer. Then we'll clean out the lint tray. No, can only you start this? Why can I start this? Dry and warm. Go hang this on the clothesline. Since dryer's not one to work. Why don't you challenge your brother in some foosball? He didn't finish his homework? No, actually, no, don't challenge him. You can challenge somebody who actually finished their homework like I told them to. How about Dream? Ask Dream if he wants to play. You, mister, finish your homework. I've asked you like 50 bajillion times. I told you to ask Dream. She's like scared of you or something. 
You. No, no, no. Wait, stop playing dolls. Potty train. These little ones. Potty train. Let's do joy first. You can go back to playing dolls here. No, now since you wanted to be like that, you can do extra credit work instead of dancing. Gosh, what a crazy... This household is insane. How is Joy potty? Okay, she just started on that potty. 9% in. Mental level 6? Good job, my guy. It's hard that any of these children are introverted living in a household of 8 sims. Ah, interesting. So the first group of boys, they are introverted. Whereas these other two, they actually have the same and they are both extroverted. Which I wouldn't see Dove being very extroverted, but that's what the game chose. Oh, I love that. How about you come over here and make some fall crafts? He's just over here doing his homework because he wanted to... What did you just ask her for? Here, potty train, Ella, and then we'll give them baths. Okay, then don't potty train her. Oh, okay, we are. I just really need to get all of their skills up because all of the kids are doing great. Like these two, they're doing great, especially Rebel. Like Rebel is my all-star at the moment. Level seven mental, level six motor, four social, four creativity. Doing such a great job. Stop dancing if you hate it. Why don't you practice the organ? Might as well have them all be musical. She has so many skills that just are level one and that's it. She knows a lot of things. She doesn't complete a lot of things. Give a bubble bath to Joy when you're done with that. Can the kids do anything with the cow? You can clean the cow? Ooh, kids are the best. They can do everything to help out. What are you doing? Dancing? Not anymore. Come clean and milk and feed the cow. What a mess. You guys have been playing for a really long time. Maybe you can be done? Yeah, because y'all need to take care of your needs. No, don't grab a grilled cheese. Those are for the babies. Come down here and grab left. Well, first clean out the spoiled food and then get leftovers. Glad the kids can help with the animals because they really are like, they mean a lot to us, okay? I've been doing a really good job taking care of all these animals. It is nice that the kids can help. Otherwise, it would just be all on snow, and that's a lot to handle as a mother of seven. Why don't you give Bluebell some advice? Call her over. Don't let her go back in there. I want to give her more attention. Give her some hugs and some pets and such. What are you doing? I know you, like, hate your brother or something, but why don't you talk to him? Your social is pretty low. You might as well talk to him a little bit. What are you up to? I'm gonna go s just play with rocking chair. I didn't know they could do that. How about you just deal with some laundry? Can you do that for me? Girl, you got a lot of kids and you haven't given any of them besides one a bath, I think. Hold on, let's check. Okay, she got a bath, she got a bath, and she's taking a nap. He needs a bath. So after he's done eating his grilled cheese, you can give him a bath. This is a lot. This household is a lot. <laughs> I don't feel like we got a lot done in this episode, but I was mainly just trying to focus on getting the kids more progress through as we do need to get them to their goals in order for them to age up and then we can complete this part of the challenge. But if you did enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a thumbs up down below and comment what you would like to see next. If you're excited for the next season, I'm super excited. We are almost done with Snow's Gen. Subscribe if you haven't already. It really does help out the channel and I will go ahead and see you in the next one. Bye.